This is James and Mitch from Gamefront with our walkthrough of Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Uh, Mitch says if I go further forward, um, he says I should run past these enemies. But I don't like running past enemies. Of course you don't. Let's just see what they say. Be wary of lying in ambush? Is that what it said? Mm -hmm. Alright, maybe I will. Imminent danger zone. Highway to the danger zone. Now, are these things hard to defeat? Uh, I actually don't remember because I haven't really tried to fight these guys. And I, I lose my helmet. Is that it? Right there? Uh, are those things? Th yeah. They, uh, they spawn some kind of thing that, like, bores into your head and it prevents you from wearing any kind of helmet. Now, if I just walk past them, do they not attack me? You can run past them. I can run past them, or I can walk past them. Uh, How many are there? Would it matter? I'm gonna kill him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ready for it. Kill those things. Those things? Yep. But I already did the thing. No, kill those things. Gotta go. And don't let them hit you. There you go. One more. It just takes one, huh? Yep. <laughs> They're dead? They're dead. See? Yeah, <laughs> see? Just learn from Not me. Not a big deal. I'm James from Gamefront. I'm an expert <laughs> gamer. What is that? There's thing? another one there. Whoops. Soul arrow it. That's not dead yet. See, I mean, the main thing about this is that they really aren't that difficult, but the risk is if they do hit you, you're kind oh, of Oh, please. Don't, don't start with me now, Mitch. They're very difficult. You couldn't beat them. <laughs> and I can't. And there's just not really that much of a reward for, uh, for killing them. Do they respawn? Yeah. You mean after you go to a bonfire? Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know that those solar arrows could hit multiple targets. I didn't either. And one more. Oh, get away from me! me. <laughs> <laughs> Losers. Losers. That was it, huh? That was it. Oh, you are a wimpy scaredy cat, Mitch. <laughs> it's probably true. <laughs> oh, don't do that! <laughs> Try a close range battle. I know what close range battle means. Do you? Pull out the Drake sword. <laughs> is this a boss? This is a boss. Why didn't you say, why don't you summon some people? She's sexy. Yeah, it's actually. Uh, oh, never mind. That's connected to that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's. She's a uh, butter, butter bottom half. Butter bottom. <laughs> <laughs> butter bottom. <laughs> uh -oh. The Chaos Witch Kellogg. I think it's Quaylog. Quaylog. Close battle. <laughs> <laughs> Why can I not roll out of the way of this bastard? Uh, it's pretty good at, uh, I guess, keeping with you. <laughs> oh. Now, the biggest and most important thing about this battle is, James, you do not want to walk into that, uh, that lava that she puts on the floor. So always, is it instant death? It's not instant death, but it might as well be. So always be aware of where that lava is. That's the most important thing to learn this way. Oh boy! What Heal was that up. move? That was uh, her little chaos explosion. Oh! Oh, why are you rolling forward? I'm trying to roll sideways, Mitch. Just <laughs> stay out of this. Or, or help. Help in some other way than you Heal are. Up. I don't know why they're saying close range battle. Oh! oh! 
Heal up, James! From game front? Ooh. You son of a bitch! Another fine mess I've gotten you into. Another fine mess you've gotten me into. <laughs> uh, now that I know what's beyond there, I'm certainly not gonna kill all those little robots. <laughs> but now I gotta go all the way back to the other bonfire, huh? What other bonfire? The one that was in the pit, this one? Yeah. I thought you meant you had to go from the, the first bonfire all the way to this one. I'd prefer it. <laughs> I wouldn't be in Blight Town, that's for sure. We're gonna have to wrap this video up here because in the end, it's it's a long, it's it's full of fail. So in fact, if you don't want to watch a video full of fail, you might want to skip the next video. But nonetheless, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're in the mood, give me a favorite, please.